Hello everyone, how's it going? I'm Wakrandor and welcome back to more Tavern Brawl. This week's Tavern Brawl is Captain Blackheart's treasure. Uh, Captain, The captain left treasure for everyone, but mostly for you. Each turn, open a chest of three random cards and choose one to put into your hand. So, this is a repeat brawl, but from what I remember, this is a pretty fun brawl. So, I'm fine with that. Uh, question is, what do we want to play? Uh... Let's go Paladin. Feeling a Paladin right now. Okay. I'm also drinking this Coca-Cola. Filled with a lot of sugar. 39 grams of sugar shit, dude. That means I've already had 20 if I drank half the can. It also has this dumb, like, quote on it where it's like, share a Coke and a song. It used to just be the names, right? Like, you're like, wow, I'm sharing a Coke with Dave. I'm going to go message my friend Dave and be like, hey, Dave. I got your name on a Coca-Cola can, and I'm sharing a Coke with you. And he's like, ha ha, that's funny. And then you moved on with your life. Now, it's like, this, this is a song. Uh, this is how we do it. Ha ha, go share with your friends. And I'm like, no, Coca-Cola. That's stupid. Let the, let, <laughs> let it die. Let the gimmick die. And just move on. All right. Uh, we get pirates. So I take it we both start with three pirates. And then we just pick cards to play. So it'll be fun. Okay. Sky Captain Craig. Humility. And the Vilefin Inquisitor. Uh, you know what? Maybe pop that Vilefin out there, you know what I'm saying? Have some fun? I think we're going to have some fun with the Vilefin. Let's get some Murloc Knights. And then, actually, we'll play a pirate, because the pirate's better. <laughs> but, who knows, we might get some great murloc cards. Might defeat him with murlocs without even trying. What to do? What to do? Who are we playing? We're playing Leo. What up, Leo? Stone Splinter Trog. I was not expecting that. Uh, Hogger, Doom of Elwyn. Ivory Knight. And Silver Moon Portal. I'm feeling Silver Moon Portal. However, uh, we gotta play a pirate first, and then uh, I'm gonna hit him in the face. Excellent. Okay. Who would I rather buff here with the portal? Is the question. I want to kill that obviously first, because otherwise it'll get stronger. Ragnaros Light Lord. Uh, that might be extremely fun to play. However, I might be able to use it for a while while something like Avenging Wrath, I can use a little bit closer. Um, I think I'm gonna take Avenging Wrath. And then let's drop another pirate and let's take this thing out. Nice. I mean, you can fire blast my pirate and kill it and then kill the other one with uh, his own pirate, but that's fine. Or do that and then. Oh god, does he have like an arcane? What? What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Man, I'm fine with that. Whenever you summon a one health minion, give it divine shield. I like Steward of Darkshire. Very nice. Uh, So now, <laughs> I'm like, okay, this is fine with me. I can just take that out. Uh, I can Silver Moon Portal. Actually, eh, it's not worth it. Uh, I think I'd rather drop like the Steward of Darkshire here. Back to your like homes. so. And then I'm just gonna, I think, take this pirate out. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Right? Mm, yeah, I'm gonna take this pirate out. But I got the only minion on the board. And when I play my pirate next turn... 
it'll be great. Or I can even portal her. Get her up to 5-5, five, five, summon a 2 cost. Will that give it Divine Shield? I think it will. That'd actually work out extremely well. Except they're fireballing it. So that sucks. <laughs> but that's fine with me, because now we got that Murloc Knight, dude. Yeah, boy. It's all coming together. The Murlocs. I can even do the Silver Moon Portal and summon a Murloc. And then we're going to be in business. I'll never get tired of playing around in these maps. Uh, alright. Next dragon you play costs two less. Enemy dragons. Blessing of Wisdom might be nice. I think I'll take that and just put it on his, uh, Blast Mage. And then let's do this. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> interesting, uh, card to draw there. So... Doing that actually screwed me over because I didn't get to summon a Murloc. So that makes me disappointed. I shouldn't have did that. But he can at least survive a hit from the Blast Mage. And then I'll have to use a Fire Blast to kill it. Then he won't be able to play any other minions because Mana Wraith will still be out there. Cone of Cold. Alright. <laughs> we got a Pirate. Kills that. Fire Blast that. That sucks. Shit, dude. Uh, Anubisass Sentinel. I could have played that a lot better. Uh, give a random minute for 3 3. That's probably good. Let's play him. Along with a pirate. Man. <laughs> I could have played the Murloc squad. I misplayed it. I done goofed. And then I could have just taken the, uh... Well, actually, no, I couldn't have killed this Blast Mage with the... things. there's only three attack. Okay, so we got another Avenging Wrath. We got Chill and Yeti, or the Ogre Magi. Ogre Magi might be nice to play with Avenging Wrath, but I can't play it, like, this turn. Uh, Chill and Yeti is probably the best bet. I'm gonna play the Yeti. Or I could throw down the Avenging Wrath, like, right now. Hope it does some damage. You know what? Screw it. What's Avenging Wrath? There we go. Got it down to three. So I can just kill that. Drop another pirate. Hit him in the face. And that works out. There's a pirate. And... And... You might feel a little Recombobulator. Alright. Amazing. <laughs> By the holy <laughs> Well... Didn't work out that great for him. Uh, we got Clockwork Knight. And... I don't even mechs though. And Avenging Wrath again, so I mean, kind of just at the point where it's like, why not? Why not pop another Wrath? I swear, every time Avenging Wrath, like, sounds, it just sounds like we're about to, uh, start a rave. It's like, and it's like, that's what I always feel like it's about to start a rave song. It's just like, nope. However, it does... Uh, help me out quite a bit, so I'll take that over a rave song. Hmm. Fire Blast, that's dead, which is great, because now I have a 5-6 pirate. Murloc down. And that is a Deathwing Dragon Lord. 
Or I can double her attack. And that's 12 damage. But I'm feeling the Deathwing, dude. We gotta play that Deathwing. Oh. <laughs> All right, so this is looking pretty good. I think we got this one. Yep, we got it. Unless there's crazy spell, but there's not. Oh. And there's not. So we win. Hooray. Victory. Ba -ba -da -da. We got the pack. All right, let's play one more. And for this one, let's go... Let's go something I nor don't normally do. Let's go Warrior. That'll be interesting. I haven't played a Warrior in a while. Now that I think about it. Where are the opponents? Rexar. We're on the Karazhan board. Begin. For Cosmodon! An extra pirate. For Cosmodon. The portal. All right. What do we want? Tyrant Warrior, Blood to Icor, or uh, Wobbling Run. I think Blood to Icor would be pretty useful. Tyrant Warrior would also be useful, actually. They're both useful. But I think I'm going to take the Icor. And then I'm just going to coin Pirate. Oh, there. Oh, there. That's a floating candle. Uh, Iron Juggernaut, Tentacle, Slam. Why not just keep taking some of these? So let's take the Slam. Welcome to the Jam. I think I'm going to do the Blood of Icor here. Take that out. Keep on rolling. Bum, 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 bum. And with 3-3, three, three, that's another pirate. All right, so Secret Keeper, Charge, and Obsidian Destroyer. Uh, what do we want to do here? I don't have any secrets. Probably either the Charge or the Obsidian Destroyer. Two attack and charge, it's kind of nice, though. So. Maybe... No, 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 no. No, 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 no. All right, let's just take the Charge. I like that. Uh, and then I could slam. I think I will. Slam that. We get another pirate. Take that out. Hit him with it. Next turn, play two pirates. Unless we got something cool to play. Fiery Bat. Uh-oh. We get the Elven Archer. Uh, we also get the Axe Flinger. And we also get Rampage. Rampage would probably be nice here because the pirates are going to take some damage. I'm going to take a Rampage. And I'm going to drop two pirates. Actually, I could take this out. I think I'll take out the bat. Take the damage and drop two pirates. Okay. Now my next turn I can deal damage, rampage, and take that pirate out. I could even charge if I wanted to. 
Charge if you want to. Bum, 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 bum. Or I could just drop a pirate in general and just give it to attack, have a 4 3 pirate. Oh, or that'll happen. Uh, deal one damage to all minions if you have 12 or less health, deal 3 damage instead. We got the Taskmaster. Probably Taskmaster. We got Enhance the Mechano as well. Which could be good if I can get like all these pirates down, but I like the Taskmaster right now. I could even use it to just take out that 4-4. Four, four. Eh. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to drop the Taskmaster. Take that out. And then let's drop the pirate. X marks the, spot. the pirate war wages on. Got six mana next turn. Alright, that's dead. And they will quick shot that. And drop a core rager. But they don't have an empty hand. There's Melkorok. I like him, and I'm going to take him. <laughs> uh, so let's drop a pirate. And let's just throw charge on it. Get rid of this core rager. Get the board ready for Melkorok. And then uh, we got Rampage if he like takes any damage or something. There's Mogor's champion. Got Slam, we got the Valdir Raider, and I mean I can get another pirate. Is that really worth it right now? I'd rather take the Raider. And we're gonna drop Malkrock, and we get the Hammer of Twilight, which is pretty nice. And I'll hit him in the face. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bam, bam. He's also got a chance to attack the wrong enemy, so if he tries to hit Melkorok and hits me instead... Ah, oh, shit, dude. Well, so much for that. That's not good. Uh, we got the Kokron Elite. That's not gonna take that out, though. We got Shield Block Draw card. Probably the best... Best option. Yeah. Uh, oh, I could also Corcron Elite so many and then Rampage Corcron. I'm going to do that. Let's do that, Corcron. Take that. Rampage. 7-5. Armor up. Take that out. Out comes our Elemental. And now we're looking pretty good. Actually, I probably shouldn't have done the elemental quite yet. Because now he can just hit that and kill it. And he'll still have one HP. Then again, I could get like a slam or something. And I keep my core crown. Tundra Rhino, Beast have Charge. And Hunter's Mark. That's not good. And steady shot. And he hits me in the face. Alright. <laughs> uh, so Shield Slam. I can kill him with Shield Slam, actually. Killing a dragon when I take a charge when you draw, deal one damage to your minions. Or the Shield Slam. So we gotta take Shield Slam, no doubt. And then we just armor up. Oh, pff, I should have dropped the Valdir Raider too. I missed my opportunities. So let's just drop that. Shield slam. Take it out. And now we just go to the top deck war. But I got a, min I got a minion on the field, so I'm a little ahead advantage wise. Actually, does, that, uh, does the 2-2 stack? Or is it just kind of 
It happens. All right, Blood Sun Raptor. Oh, Maligos. We also got Bash. Uh, would I rather Maligos or would I rather Bash or Master Jouster? But that's not gonna work, cause shit, dude. What do I want to do? I can take that out and still have my guy open. So I think I'm gonna just take the Maligos. Take that out. Okay, so that way our, all our all our like slams and stuff like that are gonna do some nice damage. Or not slam, but you know what I mean. Blood of the Ancient One. Shit, dude. I can take that out though. So that's all good. Uh oh, there he goes. <laughs> Oh, slam can do seven damage. All right, never mind. Uh, so you know what? We're gonna take some slam and slam that thing. We got a pirate armor up. We got a six three. We can take that out. It'll still be fine. Hit him in the face. Drop the pirate. Oh wow, it does stack. Never mind. So I missed my opportunity of making him even him, uh, making him even stronger. But what are you gonna do? There's a core rager. Whoa. What do we got? Uh, we got a rampage, which works extremely well. I can win, right? So we got six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh my god, I'm one away. You know what? I think we gotta do it. Let's, uh, you know what? Actually, I can just... Let's do that. That's 8-5. I'm gonna rampage him. I'm gonna take that out. And I'm gonna hit him in the face. Take the safe route. Take the safe route. Keep it going along. Hope he doesn't get explosive shot or something. It's gonna ruin my day. And then we can win next turn. Arcane shot. Alright, that's still fine. And then he'll study shot me. Uh, and then, oh, Malkarak. Nice. Let's see what we get. Oh, yeah. There it is. And I think we got this one. I think it is over. I don't think he's gonna be able to stop my gladiator longbow. Hmm. And that is it. Well played. Did you See you again. Well played. Hooray! We win. Let's drop Nefarian. And then we get two spells, and then we just hit him in the face. Hooray! Da -da -da -da. All right. So here we go. Come on, pack. We had a good tavern brawl day. Give it a few snaps. Keep snapping. Come on. Here we go. Nope. Nope. Man. Nothing. All right. Well, <laughs> one day. I'm telling you, one day, dude. Uh, either way, thanks for watching. Check out this week's Tavern Brawl, especially if you didn't get to play it last year when it was out. It's pretty fun. I enjoyed it. I won, so I very much enjoyed it. And yeah. Okay. Okay. See you.